What's up, guys? It is Matuso here, playing some more Rogue Legacy. Uh, last time I was Sir Judson, the Divine Barbarian, and I think I was also Kima right off the start. I died super fast, but I got something out of it. I can't remember what. But uh, so this time we're going to be uh, choosing between three barbarians. Ah, oh, God! I keep pressing left by accident. Oh, seriously, stop it! We got Priscilla, Chun Li, and Johnny. Uh, Johnny is gay, and he has size. I don't think being gay does anything. We got Chun Li. Chun Li is flexible. Uh, I'm not sure if that does anything. And clumsy. Maybe when I walk over something, it breaks. But she has chakras, which is really good. And I have Priscilla. She has hypergonadism. She knocks enemies further, and she is huge. I think I'm going to go with Chun-Li because she has the Chakram. Um, and now I'm going to spend my buttload of money. I'm going to get the Minor class first, I think. Oh, I, I have enough money that I can get them both. Uh, oh, oh. So close to enough money to upgrade that. But I can't, so that's okay. Nave, no thanks. Um, this is really good here. Oh, I can get this right now. Yeah, I'm going to get that right now, because obviously money gain, the faster you get it, the faster you get upgrades and stuff. Um, and I'm also going to buy double jump. See if I have any more upgrades from this guy. Can't afford that yet. Uh, can't afford that. Nope. Nothing to afford. Okay, well, I have double jump now. So, Charon's getting 165 gold this time. Double jump really helps, especially with dash. You can go jump, dash, jump. Which is super useful for, uh, Lots of fairy chests and stuff, and just maneuvering in general. I don't have. I didn't put on the haste rune. I got that last time, pretty sure. But, uh. I think. Oh god. See, I would have taken damage there if not for the double jump room. Rune, not room. Uh, just because I'm bad. And this will be easy. I'll just follow it up and. I'll shoot. Follow it up and dash. Boom. And I get a blueprint! Nice! Squire chest plate. Jump douche. Oh, Jubble. <laughs> Jubble. I just can't talk right now. Double jump didn't help me there at all. Just gathering some money. I might try to uh, fight the boss if I find it, if I have a reasonable amount of health. Because, oh boy. Because I did not so bad last time. So if I just have more health, and I had like seven health the whole time, so if I have more health, I think I can. Well, here she is. I'll grab the blueprint, night bracers, nice bracers, and another blueprint. Wow, that was surprising. And night chest plate. Hmm. I'll take this food. Okay, so clumsy. I break stuff by walking on it sometimes, or all the time, I guess. So I'm gonna fight Kiter. Uh, just a bullet hell boss. We saw that last time. Uh, but this time I have a lot more health, almost full health. Do I have full health? I have just about full health, so... I'll dodge by just standing still. Oh, huge jukes. Oh god. What's my... There it is. Ow. I'll hit him with my chakrams, because... Why not? Anything that does damage, I guess. I can stand still for one of those, and not that one either. Oh, poop. Do some damage. Dodgies. Dodgies, dodgies. Just mash that X button. Oh. Shoot. Shoot. 
maybe down here is a better spot for just dodging stuff. Not bad. Not bad. I have no idea where his hitbox is. Normally, enemies that you touch hurt you. Even if, like, they aren't covered in spikes or anything, for some reason. Jump. Woo. Just gonna... Oh. Oh, oh, nice! Last time, uh, on my first profile when I beat that guy, I was, like, level 50. I just had no... I was scared. I had no idea what to expect. I didn't even attempt to fight him. I was like, oh, there's no way. I'm still dying on basic guys. Oh, sweet! So, when you f kill bosses, you get increases. MP, HP, and MP. Nice. And that's permanent all across all of my guys. Um... Sweet, episode five, I think. Beat the boss. First, first boss, anyways. Now I'm just going to be careful. And hopefully not just die. Oh, like that. That's okay. I'll go again. I got a buttload of money. I'm not going to make you guys wait to see this. Okay. I have a miner, and he has... ADHD and daggers, so this is essentially perfect. Uh, as you can read from there, class miner, a hero to hoarder, is very weak but has huge bonus to gold. That's a 10% gold increase. Uh, so if something's worth 100, I'll get 110. Uh, and if and I also bought that uh, that upgrade, this one. So I have right now as a miner 20% gold increase, which is awesome. Um, I'm not sure I want to upgrade? Yeah, I'm going to upgrade my miner just because I am one right now. And you'll see how awesome it is. I don't have enough money for anything, so I'm just going to go. Woohoo, yay! What's up, Charon? You don't get much money this time, bro. So, open up my map. Boom, look at all that. Look at it, it's beautiful. So beautiful. I can see where everything is. I can tell you where the first boss is. The first boss is right there in the middle of my screen right now. Uh, oh wait, is that the first boss? That's probably the, the fourth boss. In the middle of my screen right now is the first boss. Uh, second boss and a third boss. It doesn't do me much good right now because I'm the miner and I don't I don't do too much damage, I don't have very much health, but if, because I have the Spelunky thing, I can just go and loot chests. I'll go to that first boss room and get those chests, and the reason you can tell is because there's two, as, as you can see, there's two right beside each other, and if you remember from right in front of Kyder, or the eyeball, uh, there were two chests, and I got both, uh, out of both of them I got, um, blueprints so that's that that was kind of rare normally you get gold see I'm getting 14 gold per thing um, per coin so that means when I get a bag of gold oh boy ah huge that means when I get a bag of gold I'm gonna get essentially four extra coins than I was getting uh, two runs ago because I got the 10% gold increase last time What's up, buddy? Stay oh, 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 yeah, I'll kill you with my flashlight! Eat it! Stab. Stab. This is hopefully not a blueprint. Bam! 140 gold. I love the miner. I love the miner so much. Just because I love this game, and I'm not really... I don't... Oh, God. I don't really want to just beat it. I do want to beat it, obviously. But I don't want to... That's not why I'm playing it. It's like Binding of Isaac. I'm not... I don't play Binding of Isaac because I want to beat it. It's like Dota. I don't play Dota because I want to beat it. I want to beat the other guys, but... I want to play a game. I want to essentially play a new game every time. Defeat all the enemies. Which I can't do. I can't do because I have daggers. Watch out! Oh, that's a flashlight. Again. <laughs> Whoops. So, an again, another easy room. Just follow it up and dash. Such money! I'm already at 672. That is an upgrade just there, and I haven't lost any health. So, there's that. 
Such dash. Such dash. Dashing is just so good. Oh, fuck. I just don't want him to attack. Yeah. Made a bunch of gold there. And I got food. And unfortunately, when I leave a room, what was in that room doesn't stay in that room. Okay, so the boss is right above me. This is a nice, fun little thing. A nice room that gave me 14 coins, and now it's playing Pistol Shrimp. This is the intro to my theme. Uh, intro to this video is Pistol Shrimp from this. Uh, it's the boss theme. I'm just going to kill this guy for no other reason than I kind of want to. Oh, hey. Oh, god dang it. As if I took a bone to the face. Biscuit's playing Dota. I could be playing Dota, but I'd rather be making a video right now. Slap. Cut dodge. Slap. And slap. I have no idea why they use... I think they're warlocks. They're all... They all end in lock. No, wait. That's not true at all. The frost one's name is Glacian, so... But I think they're warlocks. Because usually wizards don't have a lot of health, and they have a surprising amount of health for being a caster thing. I'm going to kill this guy because I think he's going to give me money, and he's a pretty easy target. Boom. That's 72 gold, I think. No, that's not even close. My math is super off. But that's okay. See, like... He takes three hits, whereas most things in this game take two. And I don't really know why. I hate fighting these guys, because... You can't really... Or... Oh, I can get it! Oh, I can totally get that. I can totally get that. Oh, just one more frame. Just one more frame. Huh. Come on! Come on! Come on! Oh, this is so... Oh, there it is! Oh! That was sexy. I'm making a lot of money this run. Just because I'm a miner. Wait, do I get 30% gold increase? Oh, it's Sonic is also playing. Cool. They must be practicing for the tournament coming up. Do miners get 30% gold increase or just 10%? I thought it was just 10%. But I'm getting... 14 gold per thing and I should have been getting I only have one 10% upgrade and then so I guess miners give you 30% which is a lot of percentages ow holy guacamole stab stab and slice don't want to die I'll get some health from this I can't go in there again and farm the boss which only makes sense because you only get better, and the boss doesn't necessarily get better. So you could just go in at there as a miner every single time and just farm. Which wouldn't be that bad. I mean, if you've gotten to that point... Oh! Jesus! Jesus Christmas! Oh, I got it! No dying from a two-so. Okay, so the only thing this flashlight does is that when I'm in that hell area... I can see in the dark, I guess, I think. I think that's all it does. I've never actually beaten the hell boss, even though I have like a level 97. Uh, I think the hell boss is pretty easy though, so... I think he's a blob-like guy. But spoilers, or whatever. Hup. I want that food. These spikes are easy to avoid if you just, like, do full circles on them. Like... I'll go get that money. Oh, God! Woo! They have a pretty quick downtime. And I, I love this game just because of the, um, the pacing. Just, in general, the pacing. Uh, slash. Because, like, you have full control of the character. I have ADHD right now. I could also have a haste rune if I wanted. Uh, if I had the money, I guess. Um, oh boy. 
So I could be going like super fast and like make precision movements and stuff. It's just nice. It's nice. It's a nice feel. I definitely recommend this game. Um, probably do a let's play and do a better job than I am. Okay, so if I go up right now, I'll go to the Maya. Yeah, the Maya, the attic. Uh, I'm definitely not leveled enough for that. I'll show you what level things are there. I just have to hit one. 33. I'm level 14. It doesn't really mean much, because if you don't get hit, you can be whatever level you want. This is the Maya again. Okay, I'm not going there. Wait, what's in that room? If I can just make it straight up, I can hit that boss room. I'll see what's after this room, because I think I can easily cross this room without taking damage. Oh, yeah, sounds like Diablo. I love it. Ooh, a pray shrine. So, I will pray for assistance. What does this do? Charon's Oval. I think this means I'm not going to spend money this time? Because all the money that you uh, have going into... Ooh! Ooh, story! Sup? Journal entry number four. Everything's about Everything about this castle is off. I can't seem to keep track of my headings, and there's no sun or stars to guide me. I find myself backtracking constantly, and I must be painstakingly... And I must painstakingly map out my progress, lest I go in circles. The maps I have pilfered off the corpses of other adventures are breathtakingly inaccurate. It is almost as if they are describing a different castle altogether. Perhaps this place does something to the mind, or are the stones truly shifting beneath my feet? Oh, dead. That was unfortunate. So I think that'll be the end of an episode. I killed the boss and made a buttload of money as the miner. So I will see you guys next episode.